12 of Jemima's first appearance. It's your key to the impossible. I say thank you guys for being this cool Yu-Gi-Oh! Monsters pixel art video. It's so awesome for you guys to be here. Today's monster that I've got for you guys in episode 2 is of Baby Dragon. Uh, before I explain about him, let me explain about myself. It's my name is Peter Elvich. Just find my planets to do my pixel art square by square, pixel by pixel, you guys can see in the time lapse straight in front of you. Um, I do all this despite my blindness in the state of Minnesota. So if you want to learn more about me, my artist statement, social media links are in the description below. So let's get right into it. Okay, so uh, depending on, you know, I mean, uh, the thing is with, with uh, monsters from Yu-Gi-Oh! is that you can be re you can be related to the series, like you can know uh, what the monsters came from, and what episodes, and all this different stuff, or you can be totally oblivious to, you know, what the whole series is about, and still enjoy these monsters, which is really why I created these pixel art projects. Um... But one of the most one of the characters I remember because it was it was part of the one one of the main characters was of jo Joey Wheeler and he had Baby Dragon a lot as a card and as a monster. So I thought what wouldn't be a cool idea is to make Baby Dragon into a pixel art piece. And he's basically the reason why he's classified as Baby Dragon is because he has a special effect with another monster that turns him into uh, what's I think if I remember correctly it's Thousand Thousand Dragon, but. Um, I'll leave that for a future video, but all right. So basically he's a, you know, fire breathing baby dragon, you know, really cool. I kept to his original character design with keeping the orange uh, and yellow kind of colors to his skin colors and to his wings. But I wanted to add some variations in my own colors with the purples and pinks and reds and all those different multicolors. Uh, the belly, as you can see, is white. That's normal, uh, except for, like I said, the variations in my own colors, um, I have a lot of fun creating the backgrounds as well. I think the background turned out freaking awesome, you know, with the multicolors of blues and greens and uh, dark blues and uh, light blues. It was just really, really fun. And um, the expression that Baby Dragon has, and particularly in this piece, I think is really cool because it's a, it's a playful, it's a playful but also dangerous um, type of pose you know of course you can see the giant claws on his feet as well as the giant claws in his hands you can see the small wings but they have claws on the wings and very you know the eyes show enjoyment but also don't screw with me kind of thing and um i just you know for those particular reasons uh because you know, I enjoyed the, the Yu-Gi-Oh! series, you know, because when I was a kid, but primarily the monsters, I think, are something I can relate to more than the actual story of it, because um, this each character and each monster has its own really cool characteristics and designs that I just particularly enjoy. And I think that you guys might enjoy, too, as you guys can see uh, this being made right in front of you, which I think is pretty cool to also have the ability to do time lapses for you guys. I think it adds the extra effect. But, um... Basically, just so you guys are well aware, my pieces are 150 pixels by 150 pixels for YouTube. Uh, off of YouTube, my pieces can be between 2 and 4 million pixels. Like I said, my info is in the description, so you guys can check that out after this video is done with. But, um... Yeah, I mean, I'm also, just so you guys are well aware, I'm also playing around with new layouts in my videos. Thus, you can see I have kind of a different layout uh, for this video than I normally have been. I am toying around with changing my layouts. Um, I'm kind of getting in my groove, so to speak, and I just kind of feel like I want to push stuff to the next level. So I want to make some really cool backgrounds and some really cool layouts for my videos. So if you guys got any questions or comments about that, you know where to put them. But, um... Otherwise, that's pretty much it. I hope you guys enjoyed the pixel art. I hope you guys enjoyed viewing the time lapse. If you did, like, favorite, and share the video. Subscribe if you're not subscribed. More icons coming out. I still want you to miss it. Otherwise, remember the perseverance is your key to the impossible. I will see you guys in future Yu-Gi-Oh! pixel art monsters videos, as well as the rest of Saturday's uploads, which you do not want to miss because there's more awesome stuff that has come out, and uh, you got to check it out. So thank you guys, and see you later.